enjoying the ride to the hill, people. So beautiful, we. Don't mind the hamps. This is good. This is good. This is good. Yes, I am at the great Musoga College Muri. This is where I went to school. And uh, today we have the Muri Old Boys Annual General Meeting MOBA, AGM. And that's why I'm here today. This is what it looks like. This is what it looks like at Musoga College Muri. Welcome to the Ham K Live Series. This is a special edition taking you back to school. <laughs> <laughs> this right here is where I went back. I went to school and I just went back today uh, for the MOBA AGM. Uh, as you can see in the background, is our little bus over there uh, that used to take us for seminars and things. And uh, that over there is the staff room. Oh, the great Muri. Very nostalgic being here. And thank you for joining me for this special edition of the Ham K Live series. I want to take you to another location so you can have a look at other parts of this wonderful school. Yeah, this is the school that you should have gone to. <laughs> so this over here is the classroom quadrangle. There are classrooms behind me. There's a main hall uh, over there in the distance. And this is the classroom quadrangle. Uh, the blocks you see all around me are classrooms. There's a technical drawing room right here, right behind me now. Uh, you can barely see it because of the shadow. Uh, but this is Soga College Muri. This is where I went to school and uh, let me see if I can show you my former classroom was over there. <laughs> that was my former classroom uh, somewhere uh, somewhere over there. I, I, I don't know. I don't know how I can show you that. Uh, but right in the background beyond that tree uh, was my class. Um, it's beautiful over over here. That was the fine art room. You can barely see it in the distance. But yes, this is Musoga College Muri. And thank you for joining me. This special edition of the Ham K Live series bringing you fresh music and inspiration. Yes, we have beginnings. We all have humble beginnings. And this was one of mine. This is the place where I learned to sing through a lot of difficulty. A lot of people told me I could actually not sing. Uh, but hey. I dare them to say that again now. <laughs> Time, resilience, patience, hard work, you know, that, that's what it takes. And uh, this is the place where we have many of those stories beginning. You can see uh, those buildings all around, classrooms and the main hall over there where there's a meeting winding up. I just stepped up to be able to do this video uh, before the, the quadrangle gets crowded uh, with lots of people. And so that I can do this without a lot of background noise since I do not have a microphone on here just now. But yes, thank you for coming through for this edition of the Ham K Live series coming to you from the Soccer College Muri. Now check this out. All right, all right, all right. You've had enough of the beautiful view. <laughs> it's me again. It's the Ham K Live series, ladies and gentlemen. 7 p.m. East African time this Sunday and every Sunday it is what we do right here on the AMK Live Series. Thank you for joining me today and every, 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 every Sunday that you get to join me here for the AMK Live Series, a time of fresh music and inspiration to jumpstart your week in style. How's been your week? How has been your weekend? It's exciting for me to be here, here at the great, the fabulous, the amazing, the incomparable. I've run out of adjectives. <laughs> My English bundles have expired. Uh, but hey, thank you for being with me right here at Busoga College Muiri. Yes, that's where I am. This beautiful view behind me is the terrace, the chapel terrace at Busoga College Muiri. That's where I am. And I decided to make this a special edition of the Ham K Live series. And thank you for joining me today. I hope you're having a great time. I just thought I'd come right here at this location because right at this location, I will tell you the story is a place where I used to sing for many, many hours growing up when I was trying to find my voice, when I was trying to find my vibe with music, when I was learning how to write and how to sing and all of those things. And man, was it a tug of war. But thanks to this space, 
thanks to the people that I had here in the chapel. On the other side of the camera is the chapel. You cannot see it, unfortunately. I thought you'd like the scenery much better. So I decided to face this direction and just show you how it is. But also, also to tell you the story, which I hope will inspire somebody. You know, when you're trying out things and when you're trying to discover yourself, when you're trying to discover your talent, you know, when you're not yet good at what you do, you're still trying to find your, you know, your space, your, your pace and everything. You'll find people that tell you, you cannot do this. You're not good enough. You don't have it. You're not talented at all. And can you believe it? Can you believe it? Can you believe it? I have been through that. And concerning what? Not football, not swimming, not boxing, singing. Somebody said to me I could not sing. And, and I remember one particular guy that told me, you're in the choir, but you have no talent. You, you have nothing to show for it. What are you doing in the choir? Why don't you try something else? <laughs> Why don't you try Duru? <laughs> <laughs> Somebody actually told me that when I was starting out with my singing and uh, it didn't feel too good. Uh, but you see, now for those of you that are not from Uganda, you do not know what Dulu is. <laughs> That's a local game that children have around here. Uh, they get little pebbles and they, 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 they dig little holes like you'd have the golf ball go into a certain hole. I don't know what that hole is called. Yeah, so, so we have this little thing for Dulu. And, 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 and the, the children use their fingers to target and, and get you know, those little pebbles into the hole and that's how they score. So just to give you a picture of what Dulu is in case you're not from Uganda, the beautiful part of Africa, that is where I am. And this is how beautiful it looks anywhere in Uganda. You'll find some place that looks this good. So come to Uganda if you haven't been here before. Yes, proudly Ugandan, that's what I am. And, and so, like I was saying, anyway, anyway, <laughs> before I went into all of that, I was telling you my story, I was telling you my story. So, right here, Busoka College Mwiri, I was in senior one, I was a little boy trying to sing and I joined the choir. I gave my life to Jesus and I was excited about Jesus and I wanted to do something for Jesus and I thought, ah, what can I do for Jesus? I think I can try to sing, so I joined the choir the chapel choir, it was called the SU choir, because SU is scripture union. And so I joined the choir and there all these kids, man, who knew how to sing, and I was not one of them. <laughs> I was not one of them, my voice was doing its own thing, uh, because I was growing up, and you know how it is at that, at that age, adolescence and all, the voice is changing and all of that, very unstable. And I had these people that were telling me, man, you, you, can, you just can't do it, okay? You just can't do it. Uh, they reminded me of, uh, of Simon Cowell, uh, 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 how he told somebody, you know, it's like a dog trying to lay an egg. You can't sing, okay? It, it won't happen. Uh, and, you know, that was really cold, huh? Uh, but anyway, anyway, nenga mulimutia. But wala speedy, but wala but it's good to be here. I'm proudly Ugandan, proudly Mwirian, Mwirian, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is where I went to school, people. This is where, in case, in case you didn't know. This is actually where I went to school. I went to Mwiri, so I got this t-shirt when I got here. Yeah, so I can feel... <clears throat> so I can feel the Mwirian in me. You get what I mean? <laughs> yes, this is the school you should have gone to. Uh, but anyway, wherever it is you went, it's all good. It's all good. We give thanks. All things work together for good. <laughs> But yes, welcome to the Hunkel I'm sorry, everybody. I am so excited. I, I'm, I'm even losing track of my own story. But anyway, being at this spot at a time when uh, many people did not even want to listen to my voice, I decided that I would start singing for the trees. <laughs> the trees right behind me. There were lots of them. There's just a few now. Uh, you know, some have been cut down. It's a shame, but we are replanting them. We are replanting them, yeah, because we, man, we have to preserve the environment, yeah. Uh, but you see the trees behind me, some few of them are still here. I used to sing for these trees. So every day I would cut, uh, I would cut, uh, I would cut out, like I told you, my English bundles are running out, man. My English bundles are running out. <laughs> but I would cut out an hour of my day, come right here at the terrace and sing to those trees. Okay, and a few people saw me do that, you know, uh, back then and they, and, and they got worried for me. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, you know what I mean? They began to think, man, he's losing it, he's losing it. Okay, he's losing it. Uh, but I kept doing that. And, and, and of course, I prayed a whole lot to God that he would teach me how to sing. And um, I don't know whether he taught me or my practice taught me, but somehow I learned to sing, all right? <laughs> fast forward, fast forward, fast forward, fast forward. About uh, two years later, I was the choir leader. Mm -hmm. I was the choir leader of the chapel choir and uh, the, the SU choir, like I told you. Uh, it went by both names because we would sing in the SU fellowships and we would sing in the chapel, the main chapel on Sunday. Uh, so sometimes we were called chapel choir, other times we were called SU choir. Uh, so I became the leader of that choir and, uh, you know, it was, it, it, was, it was an experience I will not forget. Uh, all my life I began to learn things. 
I began to grow and uh, it was just exciting growing through the fellowship here at Busoga College Miri. Come this side, uh, I have some company that is joining me here. Stay, stay, watch that, watch that, watch that, watch that, watch that. Okay, uh, I've been joined by, by company here. <laughs> we have some, some livestock coming through. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, so you can see this is not Photoshop, it is not, it's the real thing, yeah, it's the real thing, I'm on location and we have real animals going through. <laughs> I told you, I told you, this is a special edition of the Hanke Live Series, complete with cattle walking through the sets. <laughs> I'm loving these people. I hope that you are loving it as much as I am uh, because I just like to come here and have fun and just let you in on what I'm doing uh, over at my former school. And lots of old boys are here. Um, uh, I don't know how I'm going to do this. I'll see if my editor can help uh, to, to throw in some of the other beats that, uh, that I captured from elsewhere uh, in the school. Uh, so you get to look around with me and uh, see how it is. Uh, here at Busoka College Media. Otherwise, thank you for joining me today for the Ham K Live series. I just brought this in uh, to share a little bit of my, my weekend with you. Uh, but let's see, how about I do you a song live? I'm gonna go off and then come back on with the song. See you in a bit. Enjoy the view, all right? Enjoy the view. Ojo! from Busoga College Muri. Yes, yes, that's the place. How did you like, how did you like my school? Tell me, how did you like my school? <laughs> it's the Ham K Live Series, ladies and gentlemen. This Sunday and every Sunday, 7 p.m. East African time. This is what we do. It's our time of fresh music and inspiration to jumpstart your week in style. Thank you for joining me again. I hope you had a good time looking around and hearing a little bit of my story. Yes. And so, like I said, I would like to get right into the music to share something with you. I picked up something by Travis Green, one that I, I thought would uh, tie in well uh, with a bit of my story. You know, when man, when you're trying to get things together and there are people eh, just just tearing you apart, it's really awful. Eh, eh, one one doctor said, "If you know, you know." <laughs> You're trying to build and somebody's trying to destroy. Those kind of people are terrible, but God is good. He always makes a way. If you keep faith alive, if you keep, if you keep believing, if you keep on trusting, he makes a way. And uh, yeah, some, somehow, 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 somehow. <laughs> somehow you make it to where you're trying to go. Hey, just look where I am today. <sighs> man, oh man, some people, some people. That's unfortunate. Let me lower the music. Yeah, let, let me try to be very serious now. <laughs> How serious can I get? <laughs> no, but seriously, but seriously, seriously. The people that kept putting me down, the people that kept me, uh, kept telling me I could not sing, I did not have the talent, blah 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 blah, are nowhere to be seen today. I've not had one good song. Okay, let me not even say one good song. I've not had one bad song of theirs play on radio. Okay. So, be careful the things you say to people, be careful the things you say especially to young people as they try to discover themselves. Be the person that when they grow up, they will remember inspired them. Be the person that they will remember to have inspired them. Yeah? Because in Luganda we have a saying, The person that tells you something will usually forget, but you that's been told something will remember that for many many days maybe all your life so be careful what you say to people be careful how you you know what attitude you project towards people who are trying to find their footing in whatever space be the encouragement be the inspiration be the one they will remember and say man if it wasn't for so and so i would have given up there are people in my own life that pushed me forward a little bit people that said you can sing people that said you can try isaac sen kenya is one of them you know, at that time when hey, things were not adding up, man. <laughs> when I was being advised to try Duru and the Kadongo Kamo music. <laughs> all right, all right, but welcome again to the Ham K Live series. Remember, remember before you go away, remember to hit the subscribe button, remember to hit the notification button so that you know when we get live and when we have something new coming, like we're going to be doing quite a bit. Uh, in these coming weeks. Otherwise, how about we get into the song? 
Hey, shout out to everyone. Thank you for joining me for this Hamke Live series. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Music. Tell your friend right now. Hamke is live and is ready to sing for you. Huh? <laughs> So how are you doing? Maybe give it to your Jemuli. Eh? How are you doing? How's the weekend? How's everything? It's just been exciting for me, you know, just looking around and remembering where I've come from and seeing where I am today. So I'd like to share this song with you. I hope it inspires somebody. One by Travis Green. A eh, disclaimer, I do not own the rights to this song. It's a cover uh, that I believe ties in well with what I'm talking about today. Yeah. There is nothing 
that in because there's lots of people out there that see people trying to start out on things it could be a little business it could be a little something that somebody's trying to start out and they put them down and they tell them how not good enough they are how not enough training they have all of that without providing any solutions tell me I am not skillful enough and offer me a training I will listen to you okay so Let's love people, let's build up people. Thank you for joining me for the MK Live series. Remember to subscribe, remember to look out, look out, look out, look out in your favorite music stores, uh, iTunes, Amazon, Spotify, wherever it is you stream or download your music from. Remember to check out those stores and look out for HUM K H U M space K A Y and find uh, uh, you know a whole lot more of my music, my albums, and everything that I've done before. Check those out. You'll find the music inspiring. Uh, otherwise, subscribe right here. Let a friend know about this. Let's inspire more people because it's the HUM K Live series this Sunday and every Sunday, 7 p.m. East African time. We share fresh music and inspiration to jumpstart your week in style. So share this with somebody and let them be inspired in the new week. Thank you for joining me. Special shouts out to all. The old boys of Muiri, yeah, the Muirians, that's what's up. Hey, okay, thank you for joining me today for this special edition of the Ham K Live series coming to you from Busoka College Muiri and of course down here on our usual Ham K Live series set. See you again next week, 7 p.m. East African time. Music! <laughs> Sunday.